uh, greatly appreciate you taking your time to be with me. I know I take a lot of time opening these videos, so I'm going to get right into it. Let's go. First thing we have going out, Hit Parader Magazine uh, from June of 1997. Uh, this person that got this magazine also got a second one as well. But in this one, where is, I don't know if this one had the, there it is. Oh, Merrill and Manson. Cool poster. Uh, yeah. So I could tell there was a little theme there too because the second magazine they got was Hit Parader Magazine with Marilyn Manson on the front from May of 1997. So they got May and June. Might be a collector of... Uh, actually, Marilyn Manson is pretty, pretty hot that time because I believe... Yeah, there's a... Creepy poster inside, but really cool. Um, part of a lot of magazines I got. Did not expect them to do as well as they are, but they were in really good shape, so can't complain there. And then let's see. As usual, we have some cards going out. This one had to clean off the tip. <laughs> we'll just let that one go. Uh, right here we have a Shaquille O'Neal. God dang that light. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Shaquille O'Neal Panini Prism card from 2021 year. But these cards, they're so freaking cool, but at the same time, they are so hard to get a perfect 10 on when you grade them. Just because um, the, the material that they make it with can easily get scratched and messed up and yeah they're so cool to have so cool i just wish that they made the material a little bit more durable i guess you could say but i i, I love the design on these love them especially the basic silver ones like they got all these different color like green blue um different variations of it but the silver i don't know why it just stands out the most to me the black looks really good too, though, but still. And this one, this dude has, anytime I put any of his cards up, they sell like hotcakes. <laughs> um, sell like hotcakes. Do hotcakes sell? Not like they used to. But Justin Jefferson, his cards always go great. He is a hot prospect so to speak right now as far as the card game goes then this is pretty cool it was a lot that i had on auction and it went for very cheap just because it's dvds not many people want dvds anymore if they're not uh sealed but sharknado one two three and four and of course they paid shipping with this too because i wouldn't put some on auction and let it go for a dollar and not um, not put shipping on it because that'd be silly. I'd lose money. I want to at least make a. I'm not making anything really off this, but uh, these are so cool. Sharknado one, Sharknado two, Sharknado three. I think Tara reads in all of them too. Yeah, she is. And of course, the fourth awakens. Really cool. I, I, I dig these. I have only watched one, and it was not my cup of tea. I don't know if I was in the right state of mind. I needed to be in the right state of mind to watch it, but really cool it a lot. Uh, I'm just happy somebody got it for a really good price. All right, now check this thing out. Microsoft Sidewinder... Uh, how do you say this? Precision 2 joystick gaming controller. This thing, uh, good for like flight simulators and stuff. Really, really cool. Yeah, blessed. Um, it has all these buttons on there and uh, just for any typical thing. But um, really neat little item. So great pickup. 
this thing that we got here is a shirt from the Sugar Bowl um, in 2015 between Alabama and Ohio State. Uh, blue sixty, blue eighty four shirt, large. I do some research to make sure that this was a legit shirt. It wasn't just made. Um, during my research, I did find that the blue eighty four brand was correlated very well with uh, college football. Excuse me, and their merchandise. So, really cool piece of college football history that I got here. I'm very satisfied with that. And, um, yeah, went out here for a good price, too, so really good pickup. And next up we have a uh, DVD, Kim Possible. It's the live-action um, version of the movie. And uh, I, I, I couldn't believe that they made a live-action movie of it. Um. It's, I never personally watched it myself. I should actually give it a try. But brand new sealed in the package. Um, really, really cool pickup. You don't see these often. But really cool. Whoever found this, I I got a little bit of jealousy, I will say. The next we have a Wilson baseball glove or softball. But it's for lefties. So if you're a left-handed thrower, this is for you. Super, super clean glove. Looks looks practically brand new. I mean, it still has a little bit of toughness to the leather. 12-inch glove. I think I did... I had 13 when I played. I love my big glove. I got pretty decent-sized paws myself, but really nice glove. The next, we got ourselves... Oh, Fulton Bag Company uh, diaper bag. It's kind of hard to show this, but um, yeah, needless to say, it's really good shape. Had like a couple of small flaws that I had to put in the description itself, um, which made the price go way down on it. But for somebody that actually needs a diaper bag, great price. I wanted to do that for somebody, some mother somewhere. I needed an affordable diaper bag, so I'm I'm happy with the price this one out, and I, I can't complain. So I'm gonna have to take this off. Elmo's World Fish Bowl got out of here super super cheap on this one, but uh, brand new, never used. It's just. A create your own fishbowl kit and it has Elmo and everything, so it's a cute little thing for a kid to enjoy. Um, good pickup. I, I'm, I'm happy when I pick this up, and I'm sure some kid somewhere is going to thoroughly enjoy this. Now, this thing here, cool, cool, cool looking card. I love the artwork on this. Right, lucky. Regalecki, Reggie Lecky, Reg uh Yeah, Reggie <laughs> VMAX. Um wonderful looking card. I oh I love the artwork. These new Pokemon cards are just rocking it as far as everything goes right now. But this is like fantastic shape. Great looking card. Centering is off just a little from Right to left, right gots a little bit more. Right has, not right gots. But um, really, really cool looking card. I like this one a lot. Now this thing is one of the coolest things I've sold in a little bit. <laughs> and it is a Funko Pop, of all things. Uh, I just... <laughs> nothing here. Sharknado Funko Pop. This thing, so freaking cool. Love it, love it, love it. There, I'm, There's not a whole lot listed on eBay, but the ones I did see, there was flaws in the boxes or it was open. Um, but this thing sold within an hour of listing. 
and I could not be happier with that. The price was competitive with everybody else, but fantastic a little pickup by somebody. So thank you very much for your purchase. Thank you for the purchase as well on the uh, Pokemon card. I can't thank you enough.